show no mercy, Cristiano Ronaldo. And Portugal getting bodies in the way. Solovjots colliding with Ronaldo. Now Cedric. Ronaldo. Well, the trademark drag back from Ronaldo to Cedric. And there may have been a foul. I see why he's asking the question, but that type of player, I think it just invites that physical contact. He must be used to it by now. It's 15 years into a career that's been nothing short of stellar. It's pretty much match by match. Get your cameras out, girls. Cristiano playing to the crowd. Now boots Martin to Ronaldo. Offering him no space. It's not a great ball from Cristiano Ronaldo. Hangs his head in shame. Position, it's about the functioning unit of the team together, isn't it? It's about keeping distances between yourselves to a minimum, keeping in good touching spaces between, if you're a midfielder, between your midfielder next to you or your defender behind you or a forward in front. Communication is absolutely paramount. The frustration of the opposition, such as this, works in your favour. As Ronaldo turns his defender brilliantly, takes on the second and tests the goalkeeper. He makes a flying save, Van Eats. First flash of brilliance from Cristiano Ronaldo. It's the first real opportunity, hasn't it, that he's managed to wriggle away from his marker, create a bit of space. Not only wonderful technique, but great strength. It's a trademark Ronaldo power that he manages to whip up. I think it helps the fact that it's straight out Van Eens and he only has to tip it over the bar. A couple of yards out of the side, and that's the opening goal. There's Martins. Ronaldo. Now Cavallo. 1992. It's Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, that would have been wonderful because he took it magically in mid flight. He never accepts that he's offside, does he? <laughs> you never really see him agree with the decision made by a referee or an assistant referee. He was. Yeah. Wonderful touch, though, as you say, Rob, to bring out the air. Uh... How many times have we seen that? Just finds Cristiano Ronaldo. And another tidy save from Van Eens. He's winning the battle with Ronaldo so far. Options all around, but he's never going to take that one, isn't he? He's always wants to take the shot on. We've got the technical a bit. Now this. Ronaldo. more protection he may end up in the book despite being the player who was fouled if he continues to show the referee a lack of respect like that well it's less of the law rob you're absolutely right ronaldo should be in the book for that we know he's a superstar we know he's the main attraction but he can't run the game himself he's got to allow the referee to do it he wrote the first challenge very very well second chance is quite obviously a foul from sabala free kick suffice he knows what he's doing, doesn't he? But it's an obvious feat. Gomez puts the cross in. Brilliant. Jump and this. They get it in. They finally crack the code. And taking the goal from inches out, Cristiano Ronaldo. Who else? This all smiles now, isn't he, Cristiano Ronaldo? Very pitch of frustration and anger a couple of minutes ago, but sensing the chance, sensing the opportunity for the rebound from the Fonte header. It's a great run of the header at the far post by Fonte, and Ronaldo is not going to miss from inches out. That's the thing, you really can't switch off. Somebody's got to keep an eye on Ronaldo, whether it's Klushkins. Got to follow the most dangerous Portuguese player on the pitch into the box. Don't allow him to tap it in from one yard in front of the goal line. He's trying to look as he from 25 yards, but he's just good of the season for him, probably. Of all the players to leave alone in your six-yard box, of all the players in the world to leave. Ronaldo, Ronaldo, they stand off him again. It's 
takes his skippering responsibilities very well. A brave fight put up but when there was half a chance, Cristiano Ronaldo was on hand to sweep it home for his 72nd. Into Cristiano Ronaldo. And we're getting the full show tonight from the Real Madrid superstar. Nice little shot from Cedric. Now they're finding the space. Cristiano Ronaldo. Yet another save from Vanny. There's two ways looking at this, isn't there? The amount of space that he manages to work for himself, Cristiano and Ronaldo. On the flip side, no one's getting close enough to him. I think that's a fear factor from Latvia. They don't want to get so close that he rolls them and leaves them for dead. But this is a very fun. This is Cavallo. Cristiano Ronaldo, bit between his teeth. Draws defenders and forces another notable save from Van Eens. May have been going wide, but the keeper had to play safety first. Sometimes feels like teammates are inconvenienced, don't they? This is Cristiano Ronaldo. He's got options in the Cavallo. Ronaldo, he's had an illuminating game. Cavallo. Guerrero. Ronaldo. Can't pin him down to a position, Cristiano Ronaldo. Draws inside, gives it to Cedric. Cedric to Karezma, great burst of pace from the veteran. Food and drink for Cristiano Ronaldo. His second goal of the game. Both finished inches from goal. Blink and you miss him. He said, didn't we, with the first goal, he might have an easier opportunity this season, but this is going to run it mightily close. I think the deflection really does work in his favour. Again, he's always on the move. He's always trying to preempt where the ball's going to end up. Karezma deep inside opposition, 18 yards, but looking to whip the ball across, not looking to stand it up, but the inadvertent deflection stands it up for Ronaldo perfectly. And all the old boys are reunited. Ricardo Karezma and Cristiano Ronaldo who both uh, started their careers at pretty much the same time with the Portugal national team 14 years ago. And they link up again. His figures are phenomenal, aren't they? 11 goals in five matches, Cristiano Ronaldo. In the back, which is a dangerous game for Latvia. Ronaldo, well, passes on the opportunity of a hat-trick and gifts the goal to Andre Silva. And a big thank you to Cristiano Ronaldo. That's the most surprising part about it, isn't it? To all intents and purposes, we thought he was going to take the shots on himself, but Latvia 2 0 down, trying to play out from the back. Absolutely not on at all. It's not even to be commended. It's got to go. It's got to go away from your 18 yard box. Set themselves up to play Portugal on. And all Ronaldo does is has to stand there. Assist Andre Silva and again another player who's had a wonderful season at Porto. Rude goals. Loops it in. And there's a little nudge in the back of Cristiano Ronaldo. Maximenko did catch him. Maybe the referee. Nelson Simero. Cavalio. Alves to Guerrero. Gomez looks far more assured in the kit of his country than he does in the colours of Barcelona. Chase that, he says. Ronaldo at the Pied Piper. Side net, not back of the net, but he lost somehow four defenders. There. Strikes the ball over the top for Ronaldo, who's hungry for his hat trick. And stopped again by Van Eens. Unless a goalkeeper, and he could well have improved on the two. He's got a presence about him, this Romanian referee.